WFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update. And we've got a sea of green out there. I mean, everything is trading to the upside on my main screens, with the exception of Netflix, which is down 20 pennies. You got the Dow up 220 points, about six tenths, five, about a half a percent for the S&P or 21 points, three tenths for the Nasdaq 100, 51 points there, a little over one percent for the Russell, 21 point move, six tenths for the semis. The trannies are up about one and a half percent, 220 point. Uh, to the upside. Gold is up $7, with silver being up $0.10. Cents. Light sweet crude is up $0.73. Cents. Natural gas up 11 pennies. 30 year Treasury printed out at 120.01. That's up about uh, nine ticks. Let's go take a look at that nine panel market update chart. We begin with the ES Mini upper left hand side. What do we know about it? Well, it's attempting to get back inside its daily profile. In order to do that, it needs to close today about 44.47. So it's trading into some resistance areas. 44.47 is one, 44.66 is another, 45.05 above that. Spot volatility is sitting at one of those precarious spots. That precarious spot is sitting right on the 50-day exponential moving average. The 50-day is at 15.54. Currently, we're printing at 15.63. If this area holds a support, we likely see the U.S. equity futures sell off. If price is able to get below and close below 1554, we likely extend the rally. The rally extension, I've given you those resistance levels inside the ES, inside the NQ, the resistance would make it up or could make it up to 15359. U.S. dollar index does not have a top in sight unless it generates a bearish reversal candle. Short of that, looks like price wants to continue to move higher. Gold is consolidating with inside its daily profile. Resistance still at 1953.50. Support is in the zone of 1918 and 1928. Silver, attempting to form a new daily profile. The top of that profile is resistance, that's 24.78. The bottom is support, 24.16. Light speed crude. Held its uh, swing point from last uh, from a couple weeks ago, but it's still trading below the bottom of its daily profile. A counter trend move on a rally should find resistance at 81.94. You close above that, you're headed up to 83.60. Natural gas having a nice move. How much of that is a result of the hurricanes out in the uh, bay or the ones that are going to hit the west coast of uh, Florida? At this stage, well, here's what we do know. If we did form a new profile on Friday and where price ran into resistance with the top of that, that's where the sellers reside, $2.79. A 30-year Treasury, it's got a nice TD9 count bottom that's led to a consolidation with inside its profiles. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader's Zed Show, but if you have to start your Monday, please have a magnificent one. We'll look forward to speaking with you again soon. Take care now.